All right, everybody. Welcome to the Peter Schiff Bitcoin Challenge. I didn't realize that the way I had to do this uh, was with a chat where people who want to make a point can make their point. Uh, they have to do it by, by chat. And so I'm going to try my best. Hopefully this format can work. There's so much noise in this chat room because so many people are just communicating amongst themselves. So I want to get like a brand new point that somebody makes. All right, how do, I, Paul, how do I stop this thing from moving? And I know people say, well, Peter, why do you want to do, why do you want, excuse my dog. Yeah, this thing is like, I mean, I can't even read these questions because the, everything is going. Oh, wait a minute, there we go, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, no, it's not stopping. All right, there's, I, I hear, I see a slow mode, but then it just, then they, the, the things keep on scrolling and I don't even see it. When I hear people have to try to convince me that gold has no value in order to convince me that Bitcoin does, it just makes them lose the argument even more because they look that much more foolish when you have these people coming out and saying that gold has no use, right? Which is complete nonsense. Of course it has use. I mean, you know, you know, I mean, I, I, people have toilet bowls made out of gold. Now, can, can you make a toilet bowl out of, out of porcelain? Yeah, of course. But I mean, if you're really rich, and you got more money there to do it. You make yourself a toilet bowl. So you're using it. You're sitting on the seat, right? It's actually being utilized for something. Even if you can use something cheaper, you know, sometimes somebody want it, people want to be extravagant, right? And, and so so there's there's always, there's value. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, okay, guy, you got to bear with it. I'm just learning as I go on this thing. I've never done one of these before. No, anybody's going to want to buy it in the future. Whether it's a year from now, 10 years from now, 20 years from now. Is there a problem? Wait, it's it's just, it, it, it won't even stop. It's just like a... Hey, Paul, can you get, get me some water in this cup? All right, um, okay, wait, wait, okay. I got to be able to stop this from moving, or I can't read any of these... Okay, to scroll up, see, someone's giving me instructions on how to do it but it won't stop moving long enough for me to read it. I don't know, my um, my son texted me. I don't know if he was trying to send me some kind of message that I'm doing. It just, on the, well, on the top it says top chat. Can I do? Oh, he said that he had to stop watching, that it's a bad format. Um, all right, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I hope, I hope that people are getting value out of it because if my own son had to stop watching because he said he didn't like, he didn't like the format, huh? <laughs> Somebody says sunscreen has intrinsic value. I should get some. Hey, you know, the problem is the lights and the camera make me look red. And I, you know, if you see me, uh, you know, when I go in studio and I have more makeup on, uh, you know, because and everybody too, you see people on, on on studio. I got these big lights shining down on me, and it makes me look red. Maybe wearing this red shirt doesn't help. Somebody is pointing out. All right, people are actually paying money to ask me questions. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna pick. What is, that, is it, what, is, what is that? What's a CLP? Is that a, is that a, a peso from uh, Chile or something? Chilean peso? Yeah. So what currency is that? What's this hundred? Is that U.S. dollars? Someone just paid me a hundred dollars. All right. Somebody just paid me a hundred dollars to point something out. So who is this? Wolfpack Crypto. Okay. So that name is a hint that it has some, this guy likes crypto. Okay. It's thin air. I mean, the funniest thing. I don't know if anybody hasn't seen it. Go on YouTube. We're on YouTube, obviously, right now, and look for my video, um, Peter Schiff, uh, Bitcoin with uh, Sesame Street. And what I did is I took this old Sesame Street uh, skit, which I remember from when I was a kid, when this uh, you know this guy, uh, Lefty, uh, always wants to sell Ernie something. He always wants to scam him out of his money. Um, live chat, top chat. Okay, what everybody's got to do is stop. Stop texting me. Let me figure, let me figure out how to. We're texting each other. I got to figure out how to stop this thing. Um, so let's see this next one. Brandon Lee. What does Brandon have to say? I can't see. Just uh, someone's asking me what's the intrinsic value of my shirt. Well, because if I didn't have my shirt, I'd be I'd be sitting here, you know, half naked. I don't know how many people just want to stare at my body. And so, you know, to the extent that, you know, that is saving me some embarrassment.
Um, okay, here. Brock Johnson. I you know. I mean, I, plus I don't even know. I didn't even realize I was going to get money on this thing. I mean, I just found out about that people could pay me. But I guess that means you got a really good point you want to make, and that and so that that's how you can jump to the top of this chart here. Um, my generation doesn't think of themselves; they listen to YouTube. The YouTubers are shill moon boys who make money. I can't see the rest of it. It, it reminds me a lot of a pump and dump, right? That's what was going on from moving. Or if somebody is going to tell me how to do it, I got the, it's got to stop down so I can read it. Change to slow mode. I've mean, seen people. Well, how do I change to slow mode? So is it is, did everybody stop listening or was it just my son? How's it? How, how are we looking on people? Paul, can you find something on going to slow mode? Everyone's telling me slow mode. The reason I keep wiping my upper lip is I got these lights on, and so it's, it's hot. It's hot in this room. It's not that I'm nervous or anything. I'm just sweating under these lights. Oh, well. So we have 4,000 people listening or 3,000 left. So I guess people are finding value in this, uh, in this format, even if it's not ideal. The up and down keys are just making it go faster. He's sweating because he can't find... No, I'm sweating because of the lights. I just told you guys that. It's hot in here. And my air isn't working down here. I just have this... Right? Little kids believe in Santa Claus until they grow up. And they... You know, so a lot of these kids that got so excited about it are going to grow up. And, you know, they're they're not going to uh, feel the way they do now. Be smart. Right? Don't be a pig. Take some of your money off the table. Right? Take some of the winnings down. Play with the house's money if you have house's money. Don't play with your own money. Um, Bitcoin Bitcoin invented the, the piano key necktie. What did you produce? I don't get that. What is the piano key necktie? I don't know. I didn't invent anything. I've written some books, though. I think I've helped instill knowledge in people. Why, somebody asked me if I only have one shirt. Why would I have one shirt? I'm not like um, Bernie Sanders. He's got one pair of underwear. I think I've educated a lot of people, but yeah, no, I'm not. A, I'm not. A, I haven't invented things that have improved people's lives. I mean, yeah, I'm not Henry Ford or Thomas Edison. I'm, I've never claimed to be. Um, let me see. How long have I been doing? What time? My watch isn't even. It's 11:42. Oh my God! It's like it's almost midnight. All right, so I guess we can wrap this up. You know, Joe Rogan does these three-hour podcasts, but. You know, um, it's two people usually. I'm doing it by myself. Although I was, I again, I thought that I would have people uh, talking. I didn't realize that this was the format. But let's try to do it exactly till um, uh, till midnight. So I got another 17 minutes. Yeah. So someone is saying it's my shirt in the green background. So you know, my face doesn't look red in my own monitor though. I got, I'm looking at myself right now. I got a monitor, and I don't really look red. But you know, how, how do I look red on yours, Paul? Yeah, because you're looking at YouTube, and I'm looking at my my monitor here. And I put a little powder on first. I guess I should have put more. But it's probably the heat. I'm sweating a little bit because of the heat of these these lights. But um, let's see. Hold the scroll bar down. What's the scroll bar? The space bar? Wait. What's the scroll? Which is the scroll bar? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hitler confiscated gold from the Jews, and if the Jews had Bitcoin, they would not have gotten it confiscated. Well, obviously Bitcoin wouldn't have worked in Nazi Germany. They didn't have uh, computers back then. Uh, someone's saying, I caused Bitcoin to go down by $200. You know, whatever the price of Bitcoin is doing, it's got nothing to do with what I'm saying here. I mean, that's the truth. All right. It's stop. Wait. Okay. This is why, okay, this is not This is not why I don't understand Bitcoin. Part of it could be the fact that the format isn't giving all you Bitcoiners uh, a, a good enough chance to really, uh, you know, kind of, you know, put these big arguments out in front of me. But I'm looking for them. I'm trying my best. Here. Here's a guy saying, hi, Peter. Bitcoin is an idea whose time has come. I've lived in San Juan for a few years now. I've always wondered uh, what's my favorite restaurant in Dorado. Look, I mean... <laughs> I don't know. I, I I eat at the hotel restaurants mostly because I don't really get out of a, my little bubble there in the compound. If you're one of these hodlers, take some of your winnings off the table. Don't be greedy, right? There's an old saying, you know, uh, bulls make money, bears make money, pigs get slaughtered. 
All right, it's midnight. I've been doing this for three hours. How many people are still listening? So over 2,000 people are still listening. At the peak, we were over 4,000. Paul Maresca is the guy in the side who's been helping me. He drove the RV that I'm still trying to sell. By the way, no one's bought my RV. Hey, I, I, you know what? I'll take Bitcoin. Anyone want to buy? Any of you whales want to buy my RV with Bitcoin? I'll take it. Yeah, you can. You know what? I bet some some whale will buy my RV with Bitcoin just to just to promote it, just to try to say, "Aha! Look, Peter Schiff took Bitcoin for his RV." Yep, my RV, a hundred thousand dollars worth of Bitcoin. I'll sell it. It's a beautiful RV. It's in great condition. Right, it's still on my property. So yeah, it's for sale for Bitcoin. Um, anyway, that's it. Thanks everybody for uh, listening. This is the first time I've done this, uh, but I'm sure it won't be the last, especially if we get a lot of favorable feedback. Uh, and so you can certainly do that. You know, you can thumbs up this thing or like it or uh, share it or stuff like that. Anyway, uh, take care. Thanks everybody.